Hey guys, it's Chris from Destination Beer, and we are hanging out in Denver at GABF, and we are at the Paired event, which is previously known as Farm to Table. This is all about great beers, great food, and bringing them together, and you guys are no strangers to the man on my left. This is Chef Jeff from Deschutes, the famous Chef Jeff now. We made you famous, didn't we? You did, man. I love you, Chris. <laughs> You're the man, baby. Chef Jeff is joining us. They have uh, a pairing booth set up here. Let's just talk about, in general, what GABF is, just how awesome this event it's is. It's amazing. It's huge. And all the beer festival that I have traveled to from Melbourne, Australia to the East Coast, this one is still just the biggest, baddest, craziest beer fest ever. Yeah. And, and I love that they incorporated beer and food because you guys know how passionate I am about this. You are Julia Hertz, which we'll also be talking to. Um, and so they've been doing this event for about five years now. And so Deschutes is doing it this year. So talk about, we know kind of your philosophy in terms of making beer. We've, we've all seen the pilot episode, right? Right, okay, we've all seen the pilot episode. Mm -hmm. So let's just talk about what Deschutes is doing tonight in terms of bringing food, uh, beer and food together. Well, it's actually really fun this time. I'm doing uh, less in the kitchen and a lot more on the pairing side of things. And it's been uh, me teaming up with uh, Frank and Brent from uh, Russell, Bar uh, Russell Smokehouse right down on Larimer. And um, where we have our specialist, which is a um, Imperial Bitter and it's oak aged. And then we're pairing that also with the IPA. So it's kind of like, what does something taste like with two different beers that are completely different? So it's a very um, kind of exploration-based tasting area. Nice. And now you're doing a pairing with one of my favorite beers, the Fresh Squeezed IPA. Love it. Let's talk about that. You know, Citroen Mosaic Hop put together, amazing malt build, perfect amount of alcohol. Our hottest IPA out there, as you well know. I mean, we, yeah. can, we can barely keep it on the shelves. It's such good beer. If you guys have not had Fresh Squeeze yet, definitely need to try that. Now let's jump back into what you guys are doing in the kitchens at uh, in Bend and in Portland. As we know you're all about, what was it, uh, foragers, fishermen, farmers. That's Ranchers, the, ranchers creameries, all, about all the local people that the local make foods. wonderful food. Yeah. And, and so your philosophy in the kitchen is let's, let's showcase Oregon. Right. Absolutely. and bring that together and when you're doing your beer and food pairings and you make a lot of food with your beer yes. which again watch the pilot episode you'll right. see a lot of that happen right how do you when you're coming you're creating that in the kitchen how does that work for you you know it's it's a really cool thing because you know because a lot of our foods local we don't actually order vegetables it's brought to us this is our plot of land this farmer grew these tomatoes, they're there until they're gone. So if tomatoes are one of our main ingredients, well, we may want to make, uh, you know, we have some fresh hops or very similar seasons. Gosh, let's make a dish with, you know, fresh hops and tomatoes. Nice. So that's a really easy way to sum up our philosophy in the restaurants up in Oregon. Have you had a chance to try some of the different pairings here tonight? Yeah, and I, I, don't, I, I haven't had a bad one yet, man. <laughs> right? Fantastic stuff. Yeah, there's great some really good stuff. Here. There's yeah. some really great beers here. Um, if you guys ever have a chance to, to get to Denver for GABF, get a ticket prepared. It is just absolutely worth it. Great beers. I've got the Fluxus from Allagash. I got Fresh Squeeze. You got Fresh Squeeze. <laughs> Can't go wrong with that. It's a lot of fun putting beer and food together, and we're going to show you a little bit more here in a little bit. So, Jeff, thanks for being here again. Great we to see you, We love you, Chris. man. Cheers, bro.